Maria here and today is Thanksgiving Monday in Canada. So for anybody that's watching from any other place, I want to say Happy Canadian Thanksgiving! Wow! So um, I thought I'd just do a quick video. I thought that it's a perfect time to do my fall favorites tag. So there's a, a favorites tag that's going out there. Uh, going out and about uh, that was created by Jacqueline Hill and nobody tagged me uh, which is totally fine nobody probably even really knows about me except for the few of you however I thought I'd join in and play because I like playing yay so um, I thought I'd share with you today my fall favorites so the first question is what's your fa favorite fall candle and I would have to say that my favorite is uh, Leaves by Bath and Body Works. It smells kind of cinnamony slash apple-y. It just smells really pretty. So when I think about a cozy, warm fall candle, that's the one I would go for, Bath and Body Works Leaves. Uh, the next question is, uh, what's your favorite lip color? And it would be Bite Beauty's Cava. It's kind of like a muted, um, I don't know, muted mauvey plummy gray. So that's the color there. And it's what I've got on today. And it's just, it, 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 it like, especially I'm, I paired it with the Mac stone lip liner and it looks quite gray, uh, almost sepia looking, I guess would be the tone that I've got going on here today. And I kind of just really like it. It's, it's kind of dark without being uh, a berry or, you know, the dark vampy lip. Uh, so it's super wearable and it's what I usually go to in the fall. So yeah, that's my favorite for fall. Yeah. The next question is what's your favorite drink? And it's one that I make myself. I get myself a really big mug and I put strong coffee in it. And then I take um, Cadbury hot chocolate and it has to be Cadbury. I don't like any other hot chocolate. And I take a ridiculous amount, so I take a tablespoon, and I probably take about that much, so heaping. I do two of those in a big mug, like huge mug. Huge, really big, yeah. And then uh, I mix that up, and then I take, I, normally I put cinnamon on, on the top when I make a mocha, but um, I've been really loving putting pumpkin pie spice. So the, the Cadbury hot chocolate is a must with the coffee, but um, if you want to up it a notch and make it seem really fallish, put in the pumpkin pie spice instead of cinnamon, and it's just awesome. I love it. So it's super cozy, super decadent, and I love it. Uh, the next question is favorite fall blush, and I would have to say my favorite fall blush is MAC by Cubic. I, like, are you guys getting sick of me talking about it? I love this shade. Um, in the summertime, I tend to go with more pinky hues, uh, but in the fall, I gravitate towards this a lot. Uh, again, it gives just kind of that muted plum look, which I'm really into for fall. So next question is favorite fall clothing item. So I have to, my first, well, the first, across the board, my, the thing that I look forward to wearing the most in the fall are boots. I just, I love tall boots. So this is my favorite one and it's uh, by Miss Moose and I just love it. I, it's super comfy. It's got kind of a round toe. Love it, love it, love it. And yeah, the, this is my favorite boot. Um, the other fall item that I can't wait to wear are these, um, just show them to you. Ah, oh, can you see? They're kind of a plaid legging and I just absolutely love uh, wearing those. Just love them. I really love the boots I'm wearing too. So boots, but also these leggings. So the next question is what's your favorite fall movie? And I, I, I don't really have a favorite fall movie that I can think of because if there's ever a time where um, I want to just uh, be all cozy. I think Christmas movies, like even if it's in July, <laughs> it'd be a Christmas movie. So my favorite fall movie or any sort of cozying up uh, movie would be Borrowed Hearts, which it, it, it was, um, it, Roma Downing is in it and it's kind of a cheeseball movie, but it's kind of romantic. I think it's a Hallmark movie actually. 
Uh, but I just, I really love it. It's kind of sweet and I can watch it like it's, it's family rated. So uh, yeah, I just really love it. There's a little girl in it. It's kind of a cute story. So that would be my favorite fall movie, Borrowed Hearts. And then favorite fall TV show. I don't have, um, like I don't have cable or anything like that. We don't watch a ton of TV. We have Netflix, but that's it. Um, so I don't even know what shows come out, uh, TV shows come out in the fall. However, um, when I think fall, I think of X Factor UK and Australia. Um, so both of those kind of come out in the fall time and I'll oftentimes just YouTube it and, and watch uh, the, in particular, I love the Australian one, I'm not sure why, but I also love the UK one. So I'll watch those, I guess. I hope that counts. I don't know. Um, the, the next thing is favorite Thanksgiving food. And I would have to say my absolute favorite Thanksgiving food is like, well, it's all my favorite. Like, as I, I really, really love food. But if I had to choose a one, it would definitely be stuffing. I, stuffing is what I look forward to anytime there's like a turkey type meal going on. It's a stuffing that I'm into. And um, it, I loved my mom's stuffing. I was very possessive <laughs> of the stuffing as a kid. And now I just make so much, it defies description. So I always have a whack load of stuffing left over. So I, I can, yeah, I, I just absolutely love stuffing. So it's my favorite. Uh, but in particular, it has to be my mom's recipe. So I learned her recipe, that's the one I do, and that's the kind I like. So yeah, too bad I couldn't feed it to you through the camera, but it's it's good. It's just bread and onions and celery, and my mouth is watering, tons of butter, mm, and then poultry seasoning. But you gotta get the, the right kind of ratio. I don't know, I just love it. So uh, yeah, favorite food, stuffing, big time stuffing. Um, the last question is, what's your favorite Halloween costume? And I'm not, I'm not a huge Halloween fan. I know tons of people are. It is not anything I really enjoy at all. However, if I could dress up in a costume all the time, I probably would because I am a drama queen. I don't know. I love... I love dressing up and doing all sorts of things. So um, the costume, I can remember years ago, I haven't dressed up for Halloween in years, uh, but the one costume that I really enjoyed putting together and making, and that to me, the fun thing about doing something like a Halloween costume is making it yourself, not just buying something ready-made. I really love the idea of just putting together a hodgepodgey weirdo situation. <laughs> Uh, I kind of am a hodgepodgey weirdo situation. <laughs> anyway, um, my favorite costume that I ever did was, um, it was in college, and I did my makeup like cats from the Broadway. I happened to have a picture uh, of a, one of the, the cast members, or like the cast, uh, I found it somewhere. It was before YouTube or internet, so <clears throat> I found it in a magazine or something, this picture of the cat's makeup. And so I copied it and I was so excited at, at how you can change your makeup so easily by just, you know, putting lines and different stuff like that. I totally looked like a cat. Like it was so cool. And I sprayed my hair uh, up and into kind of like um, floofies. I don't know what you'd call it. But anyway, I, I figured I looked like a cat. Like I was impressed anyway. <laughs> I don't know if anyone else was impressed, but that was definitely my favorite uh, Halloween costume. Does that work? It's gonna have to, yeah. So that's it for my fall favorites. Um, hope that you enjoyed. If you did, give it a thumbs up. And I don't know many people on YouTube uh, because like I said, I've just started. 
So, um, but I do know one person and I'm gonna take her. It's, uh, her YouTube channel is Real Girl Life, Melissa Bueller 86. So Melissa, you're tagged. I wanna know what your fall favorites are. And again, to everybody, happy Canadian Thanksgiving. I hope that today is a day that you think about what you're thankful for. It's God's will for our lives that we be thankful and thankfulness just makes everything so much more happy and enjoyable. So. Be thankful, I'm thankful for you guys, and um, I guess that's it. I'm gonna go enjoy time with my family now. So have a great week.